You've heard me say it before and it's still true. Learning is earning, but not all learning is created equal. And when it comes to maximizing your earning potential, here are four books that I found incredibly helpful that have helped me earn millions over the last couple of years. So book number one is The Richest Man in Babylon by George Clausen. This is the foundation. If you want to win the money game, you gotta understand the rules. And once you understand the rules, then you can start building out the strategies to actually go and win. This is foundational. Understanding personal finance at its most basic starts here. This is a very valuable book. It's really easy to read. You have no excuse not to go pick it up and master the fundamentals put down in there. And from there, then we can start building into book two, which is the E-Myth Revisited by Michael Gerber. Now, 93% of individuals with a net worth over $5 million, they own a piece of a business. So if you want to generate wealth, you have to own a business. I'm sorry, there's no really, there's no good way around that. At some level, you have to own a business. Now, the problem for most people is when they go to build a business, they do it wrong from the start. And what they've actually done is they've just created a job for themselves, a job that they'll never be able to work themselves out of. And it's not generating the type of revenue or income or lifestyle that they're really after. Because again, money is just a tool. It's what it enables you to do that makes it so valuable. And if you don't have any control or freedom over your life and you're just stuck working in the business all the time, well, that's no substitution for just working at a W-2 job. That's, that's not what we're after here. So this book is gonna help you learn how to build an effective business working on it, not in it. And, and I think there's something that um, everybody should take away from this book. Even if you have no entrepreneurial spirit, but if you want to generate income, like this is the way to do it. Build the business. Number three is The War of Art by Stephen Pressfield. Now, this book is ostensibly about the resistance that we all feel when it comes to creating something. So I started my entrepreneurial career as an author, writing books and creating stories. And when you go to create something, you feel this, this silent resistance and this voice in your head that tells you you shouldn't do this or this feeling like oh that sucks i don't want to do the work and this book is all about how we overcome that resistance so that we can actually do extraordinary work now whether whether or not you're an author or an artist of any type we all feel that resistance we all feel this i don't know this this pressure in the morning when you wake up and you're like i don't know if i want to go and put in the work and that's the only way to get to the outcome it's the only way to show up every single day do the work put in the hours and it's not not comfortable it's not easy if it was everybody would be doing it so this book i would say is a killer mindset book for anybody struggling to show up every single day and do the work which is a prerequisite of success and then book number four is influence by robert cialdini this book is i would say the the bible of influence and persuasion because at the at the core, we're all just people. And if you want to go far in life, it's going to be predicated on your ability to work with and through other people. And we all want to be more influential, but we don't necessarily know how to do that. This book helps. It lays out in very clear um, ways that you can improve how your influence with your friends, your family, your colleagues, um, vendors, customers, whatever it is. We all want to be more influential. So by mastering these fundamental psychological principles, you're gonna be able to do that, which is gonna make you much more potent than when you're going and building a business and creating whatever it is that you're trying to create and put out into the world. So those are four books that have been immensely impactful in my personal life and have helped me go from where I was 10 years ago, which was $80,000 in debt living in the back of a van, to where I'm now, which is pretty good. So I hope these books help, guys. I'm really curious. what. Uh, what books have been really influential for you that have been a game changer or a paradigm shifter in your life and how you've approached the act of making money? I want you to put that down in the comments. Let me know. I want to hear from you guys and we'll see you tomorrow.